everyone welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time here welcome my name is Callie and this is my YouTube channel dedicated to all things nails and good vibes if you'd like to see a new video every week Tuesday and Friday you can definitely subscribe and hit the bell so you never miss any new uploads so today I'm going to be sharing some I don't know what I'm gonna call this video yet as of when I'm doing the voiceover I haven't decided on a title but you would have already seen it so in any case I'll be showing you four Disney nail art designs this was for a collab that I was participating in on YouTube and I really wanted to do a Disney nail art tutorial as well so I figured I would combine the two. So today I'm probably going to call this something like favorite Disney movie nails or something because I did four designs and these are four of my favorite Disney movies ever. So let's just get into the video and I'll figure out the title later. So these are all pretty simple and I'm excited to share them with you. So let's get started with the first design. First up, we have a design inspired by the movie Frozen. It's a really simple kind of gradient snowflake design. I really like how this one turned out. Frozen, if you didn't know, is my all-time favorite Disney movie ever, so I'm a diehard fan, so I had to do one for this. So I started with two coats of a light blue polish, and by the way, I'll have all these polishes in the description box below. Then I took another polish that was slightly darker, and this is also kind of a periwinkle blue color, and I just did a really loose gradient. I didn't want to do an actual gradient, I just wanted to add a little bit of color to the tip of my nail. So once I did that, I grabbed a holographic silver polish and a detailing nail art brush, and I just added a little snowflake. This came out a little bit thicker than I would have liked, but I still like how it turned out, so that's really cute and very simple. Next up, we have Esmeralda's dress, and Esmeralda is probably a lesser known Disney character. She's from the movie The Hunchback of Notre Dame, and that's actually my second favorite Disney movie ever. So first I'm starting with this lighter kind of cream white color. So I figured I would just do her dress for this since it's a really pretty design, and it's really simple too. Then I took a darker blue shade and I did a, probably a square shape about three fourths of the way up my nail and then once I had that on my nail I added some yellow stripes if you need some reference photos you can look up pictures of these characters from the movies or any just photos that you want to look at while you're inspired so like pictures of the characters or of the scenery or the posters or anything like that it can be really helpful so I just did that with the brush of the polish and that was it for this design one more design for a dress sort of concept. I'm going to be doing a really simple Rapunzel's dress because Tangled is my third favorite Disney movie ever. So I took this really pretty purple color. This is an OPI polish. It's actually one of my favorites. So gorgeous and the formula is fantastic. I just did two coats of that to start. Then I took a pink polish by Essie and I used a detailing nail art brush to add the laces that are on the front of Rapunzel's dress. Again, these came out a little bit thicker than I was hoping. I need to get a new nail art brush because this one just isn't as thin as I need it these days. So definitely use a toothpick if you're going to do this at home. I think that would work a lot better, but it's still cute. Finally, we have an Enchanted Rose design. This is inspired by Beauty and the Beast, my fourth favorite Disney animated movie. So I started with this really pretty yellow color and this actually seems really perfect for Belle's dress. So at first I was going to do another dress design, but since I already did two of those, I figured I would change it up a little bit. So once I had my yellow base, I grabbed one of my favorite red polishes and just created a really simple rose outline on my nail. This doesn't have to be perfect. I didn't want to do this super detailed today because I was kind of pressed for time. So I just did this really quickly. Then I took a sparkly green polish and added a stalk to the flower and off camera I added a little bit of sparkle to the rose just to give it a little extra detail. So of course if you do any of these designs you'll want to finish it off with some top coat. I just did that for all of these. I actually really like how all of these look together. I think they complement each other really well and I just really like all of these movies. They're some of my favorites from Disney and I'm just very happy that I got to put them into some nail art for once because I haven't done Disney nail art in so long so this was really fun. Again this was part of a collab that I did on Instagram so the collage should be up by now so you can go check that out on my profile. The link will be in the description box. Let me know in the comments which of these was your favorite or if you'd like to see me do any other fun and simple Disney nail art I would be very happy to do that so I hope you're all having a really nice day and I will see you in another video very soon same nail time same nail channel have a polished rest of your day bye